In the recent chapters, it was continually hinted about the seraphim control hierarchy. Five Elder has the highest authority than Vegapunk. And we got to know why it was hinted many times. Because one of the five elder Saint J. Garcia Saturn was on move. And he was accompanied by Kazaru. No, let's talk about why Saturn is here. First, we saw Sentomaru was having control of Seraphims. Sentomaru was having higher authority control over Seraphims than the Cypher Pole. So, in order to gain control over the Seraphims, Rob Lucci knocked him down. Later, due some system failure, Rob Lucci, Kaku, and Stussy manages to reach Labo phase where Vegapunk and Straw Hats are. And Seraphims also followed them. Due to which Rob Lucci was shocked. Even though he didn't order the Seraphims, then also they followed him up. But Vegapunk Shaka explained that depending upon the situation, Seraphims have decision making ability. Seraphims joined battle with CP0 agent they outnumbered Zoro and Brook. So now situation was going against Straw Hats and Vegapunk. So Lilith and Edison decided they will go out and help Zoro and Brook by again gaining control over Seraphims. Rob Lucci was knowing that Vegapunk will come out to gain control, so he ordered Seraphims to destroy the Labo phase. Seraphims followed his order and started destroying Labo phase. But later Stussy bitten both Kaku and Rob Lucci on neck due to which they fall asleep. And we found out the true identity of Stussy, she was working as a double agent for Vegapunk. And she was the mysterious character that Vegapunk was talking. But after knocking both of them still Stussy can't command the Seraphims to stop destroying. Because she and Rob Lucci has the same authority level, so she can't overwrite Rob Lucci order. But don't worry we have Vegapunk here who has higher authority than CP0. So Edison and Lilith came out. But they were attacked by S-Hawk and S-Shark. But they were saved by our star performer Sanji and Zoro. Edison commanded the Seraphims to stop attacking. Straw Hats and Vegapunk think that big trouble is averted. But this is the calm before the coming storm. Gorose was knowing this may happen CP0 agent may lose to Vegapunk. Because Vegapunk has Seraphims and other advanced technological weapons with him. And Straw Hats came out of syllabus for them. Gorose know the true strength of Seraphims they are a powerhouse. So to get the Seraphims on their side. And they are going to play a big role in the final war. One of the five elder Saint J. Garcia Satins and Kazaru is heading towards the Egghead Island. It was kind of surprising for us that Kazaru did not get an order from his higher up than why he heading towards Egghead. So he got a direct order from Saturn. Saturn is here to take Seraphims and to kill Vegapunk. Kazaru's presence is likely to ensure that Saturn is able to get within range of the Seraphim to actually control them, which is likely to lead to some of the Straw Hats clashing with the Admiral. We might even see Saturn as a combat clashing with Luffy. Rob Lucci and Kaku too are not going to sleep for too long. Both of them soon we see in action. It will be kind tough for both Vegapunk and Straw Hats to escape from the Egghead Island. That's all for today's video. What is your opinion comment down in the comment section.